in the fuck are you guys doing today? It's Justin. Well, back at you with another fucking repair video, if you get what I'm saying. Uh, today we are working on the dump truck bed. That's why uh, you guys are actually in the bed. I'm going to be showing you what we are going to be doing. As you can see behind me, up over fucking there, uh, we got my new welder. And then right there, we got the old plasma cutter. So we are cooking with fucking fire over here. But what we have to do is replace um, the hinge. This, this hinge right here is what holds, this is what holds the bed closed, okay? And uh, we had a dumb fuck that used to work for me, no longer, okay? And I have a feeling what he did is he would sh hit the latch, close the latch, and then fucking slam the gate. And this pin that's welded in here for this grease fitting fucking broke out. And then the hinge don't work. So I'll kind of show you where it is over there. Then we'll get you set up and we're going to get right into this right quick. You know, we ain't got all goddamn day. I got my new Milwaukee safety glasses. I don't know. I just thought I'd wear them just because. But whatever. So as you can see, uh, this goes right here. And uh, we're going to have to plasma cut this out and all that stuff. And then, you know, we got to feed this down into here because, uh, well, you can't see it in there. I'll get you a light. Hold on here. Going to get a light. So I've been waiting on this for a couple weeks. I'm going to tell you uh, kind of the stuff that's been going on. So... Alrighty, as you can see up there, you see how it all mounts up in there and all that shit. So, uh, hopefully that's not welded on the bottom down there. If we are, we are, we are fucked. Okay, but you can see that that pin broke out of there. So we're going to plasma cut this off. Let's see if I can... See if, let me see if that's welded down in there. Oh boy, it's not gonna be good. Cause we're gonna have to do some heat and beat here. Uh, we have to do some heat and beats. <sighs> you know, always something. Oh boy. Why in the hell would you weld? That like that. Oh boy. Okay, well we're going to start out over here with the old plasma cutter and see what we got. Party there, YouTube. Let's hopefully not catch ourselves on fire here, but uh, let's see what we got here. I'm going to start about uh, 25 amps and kind of see what we got. Okay, 25 amps is getting wild with it, and I'm getting shit thrown all over me.
Okay. Now let's get a hammer and see if we got that loose. We got that loose there, YouTube. No. All right. So let's turn some more heat up here and see if we can get this cut out of there. in the hole there. All right, we got the asphalt in there on fire. That's not good. Jesus Christ. Son of a bitch. Okay, what I think we gotta do is come down here and suck some more of this out. to grind this back down. Thank <laughs> you. 
got down. You gotta put the asphalt out. Okay. It seems that we're hung up. It seems like we're hung up right here. Nothing a grinder can't fix. God damn! Cause I feel like I got. Yeah, we're just hung up down here. I'm going to have to rethink this here because it's, I got it opened up all the way down here. We just can't get in there to grind that out. we got to rethink what we're doing here let me see how loose it is and where it's hung up at But I got this. Okay. So we're definitely hung up right here. They got so much weld on this thing. Okay, so we're gonna have to grind this out pretty good once we get it cut off there. Because I see that. Come on. See, it's like right there. They got.
I'm going to use some more amp. We may have to attack this a little bit more because we're running out of where we get the plasma cutter in.
got to figure out why they welded it like this. Okay, this is not good. Fuck! How am I gonna get a torch in there to cut that out? Because they got it welded along this seam. Oh, they got it welded along this seam. They must put these in first is the only thing that I could think of. But the problem is, is there is... Yeah, they got a bead right along here. Okay. Because I feel like I got it loose. Everywhere else. How do I get in there to get that out? Hmm. Hmm, 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 hmm. Hmm, think, stupid. Think. So if we cut this straight off here, will that be able to let us get in there? All right, I thought this was gonna come out one piece, but right here down along this seam, they got a weld. Now, the only problem is... Ugh, I cannot get in there. See, I thought they just had it welded right around here and around the bottom. I got in over here. Um, shit. Let me, let me think about this for a minute. Alrighty there, YouTube, uh, we finally got that thing out. Uh, what I had to do eventually was take uh, some 7018, I didn't have the right rod, and I just turned the welder up to 300 amps and just burnt this out. So really what I need to buy for the next time is I was looking, I went and looked on uh, Hypertherm's website, they have a pencil tip that we need to get for a plasma cutter. Uh, because I can tell you, uh, this is probably not the last time this is gonna happen. So what we need to do is uh, clean all this up and then we're gonna get ready and uh, see how this Ooh. so I think that was you got to figure out how to get that in there like that because whoo that's gonna be some shit to fucking fill okay so I think it goes right about there, and then we're gonna have to fill all this in uh, with weld. I think that that looks pretty good. Now what I did do is I measured this. So this should be right about there. Okay, so then what we're gonna have to do is that's a pretty big gap there. On the bottom, I think we could get it. You know, the problem is, is I cut 
some of it out. That's okay. So I see why that lip is there. All right, then we'll just bring this back like that and then see if we can get you know and then we'll put a big tack there and we're gonna have to build up quite a bit of weld um, I don't like it like that so I can see that that's kind of where it went before and then we're gonna have to do some serious fucking welding on this so let me get it kind of cleaned up so it's not so rough edges and all that stuff and then uh, I will come back to you alrighty uh, we finally got her all welded up in there and all that stuff uh, now kind of the important thing was is I fucked up and I put it in there once but I had it back too far and then I got it kind of excited with the TIG or the MIG welder. So I had to go cut that out. Well, then I got a lot of porosity in it and all that shit. So it took me a little bit to fucking build up this weld here, grind it all down and all that stuff. But uh, I feel like this is in there a whole lot better. This door is rock solid. I feel like I got good penetration. Uh, I know this weld doesn't look the best. Uh, it's because I had to grind on top of it and do a whole bunch of other bullshit. But I finally got it to where I feel that it's uh, pretty good. So now what I'm going to do is go uh, unlatch the thing for you, make sure all that works. Um, we got it all bolted up in here real good. So now that this is tight, uh, you know, this won't move anymore. Uh, if you guys ever have to do this, what I will tell you to do is shut the door, uh, get it to where you can get it latched, you know, like tack it up here to where the door is. That's the easier way to do it. Um, other than that, uh, that's really uh, this fucking repair. It was just a whole bunch of me fitting it and all that shit. Then I forgot to turn on the goddamn camera and I got excited with the fucking new Miller welder which I'll give you guys a complete review on that once the cart and all that shit gets here. I just had to get this fixed uh, because this truck's got to run Sunday night on Father's Day. So I just wanted to get all this stuff done. Uh, that's pretty good. I will have to do another one of these. The truck is broke. The other one is broken. So uh, hopefully that won't be that bad. Uh, but I got to get that pencil tip to cut that out of there but other than that uh, this is how you replace a dump top truck lock on an arm bed I uh, hope you guys enjoyed it uh, like always uh, thanks for watching check out Instagram patreon all that jazz all that social media bullshit and uh, like always I gotta fucking go